Coding is the process where you put like an algorithm. An algorithm is a is a series of steps to a goal into computer language so that the computer can understand and do. So we began our coding class with kindergarten through fifth grade students. It was originally designed just to expose them to computer coding. So what happens is that the students have to logically think. They have to figure out, okay, what are some other options? Let me try to problem solve. Let me try to figure out different ways. So they try and then revise their solution and then they try again. So it actually causes them to think critically about ways to approach problems, ways to create solutions, and that's really what computer programming is all about. I like writing code because like I play a lot of, I'm like a gamer, per, I'm a gamer person, so I was like, so if coding, they said coding would be like, would be like you could be able to make a game with coding, so I was like, yeah, I'll make a game when I grow up. We're learning algorithm, which is a set of instructions. We're also, no, a step-by-step -step process. Um, and we're also learning debugging, which is finding the problem, then fixing it. If we start in kindergarten teaching them how to use the computer, the shortcuts, how to type, become familiar with the different functions of a computer, by the time they reach fifth grade, testing online for them will be very simple. This one is a big mistake. No, I had to take this into the trash can. I had to move, move west, 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 and then I press north, north. And then I press run. I'll get to the pig. Show code and see the code. So I press continue. Our whole goal was to expose students in kindergarten with computer code. And by the time they reach fifth grade, they'll be able to code or program their own games, be able to manipulate computer games that are already present, and just imagine what they'll do when they get to high school or even beyond that. They'll be experts.